Eric. As always, I want to thank you for taking a couple minutes and checking out my video. On this episode of Smoking, I'm going to give you a review of a restaurant called Milwaukee Burger Company. Now those of you that are familiar with my channel know I usually do uh, video uh, recipes and uh, share them with you. Uh, stuff that my family and I enjoy, whether it's uh, barbecue and smoking, slow cooker casserole, or even and uh, the cooking. Milwaukee Burger Company has, uh, I think, seven locations only in the state of Wisconsin. And the very first restaurant they opened up is right down the street from where we live. So today I have the day off. We're like, let's go down there and check it out. So that's what this video is. No uh, cooking video, but just a review of my family and I going there. You check out our food, see what kind of place it is, and then at the end, we'll tell you exactly how we like it. So stick around. I'm going to show you a great new restaurant. Let's get cooking. Hey everyone, it's uh, Sunday fun day in Sunday Wisconsin. Fun day. Oh yeah. Well, we're, a... we're here with the whole family, Monica, Ava Gray, say whoop, say hi, hi Kyle. Hello. <laughs> hi. And we're, we're heading to a new place that uh, we haven't tried yet. We went to the Northern Tap House because we wanted uh, Kyle and Ava Grace, well not Ava Grace, we wanted Kyle to try the cheese curds there. They were the best cheese curds we've had since uh, yeah, coming to Wisconsin. And we went there uh, when we were out here in October, just Monica and I. So we went there and then we were telling the waitress, man, we really love these cheese curds it's our favorite here. favorite ones. And she says, oh, you know, kind of under her voice, not wanting to get in trouble with management. Well, have you ever had the cheese curds over at uh, Milwaukee Burger Company? And we're like, no, why? She goes, oh, they're gigantic. And it's a good restaurant. You should go check it out. But it is owned by Northern Tap House, so it's not like she was sending. Oh, is it? Is it the same? Yeah, owner? she said Northern Tap House actually owns that okay. Milwaukee Burger Company. So. Well, I didn't know that. But anyway, we're heading down to Eau Claire. Uh, it's lunchtime. I'm starving. I've only had a couple cups of coffee. We're gonna try some cheese curds, and then I guess they have some crazy burgers there. And uh, hi guys. Guess what? What? Crazy but the puppies are sitting in the middle too. Oh, okay. So they're gonna be in the too. Oh. So we're having a nice country so. drive. All right, so yeah, here we are. We'll uh, meet you guys at the restaurant and we'll see what kind of food it is. I have no idea. I know it's burgers, I know it's cheese curds. What more could you want when you're, uh, cheese. When you're in Wisconsin? Mm -hmm. Just give me a bunch of cheese curds, I'm fine. <laughs> give me a little look of uh, where we're going here. This is uh, the little side road off away from our house and uh, we're out in uh, Wisconsin. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of farmland out here. Yeah. There's the police station. Yeah, they got the police station over here on the left. That's where we got Dixie's dog license. You know, she's That's right. And this is the way I go to work too. This street I turn right and then we're at my work. I'm like 10 minutes, not even, five, six minutes away. Yeah. So we'll meet you guys at the restaurant. All right, here we are. Milwaukee Burger Company and Kyle noticed all they have is uh, cold beer and margaritas. Sounds like somewhere <laughs> you'd like. <laughs> all right, guys, meet you inside. Camera, the, the joke. Um, how do you get a mouse to smile? How? Say cheese. Say cheese. There you go. <laughs> so, guys, I wanted to show you the, the beer menu here. How many beers did she say they had on tap? 36, I think, rotating yeah. beers. She's going to bring me a couple samples before I order. I was going to try, let's see, I was going to try the Tropical Face Punch from Amherst, Wisconsin. And then the other one she said was good was uh, Deadly Allure. So I'm going to try those two. All right, here we are. Look at this. I like their little slogan here. 100% Wisconsin, the way it should be. And of course, we're going to try the cheese curd sampler that has all the different kinds. I guess they're like golf ball sized cheese curds. And they got wings, and then they got sandwiches, and then of course, they're known for their big burgers. So we have Pepsi products, Mountain Dew, Dr. Pepper. We're going to try this in a second. What are you going to get, Cub? you know? No clue. No clue? <laughs> That's kind of a nice place. 
So, after looking at the menu, Kyle's going to get the hangover, which, where's, Kyle's going to get the hangover, yep, double American cheese, cheesy hash browns and a fried egg, Monica's going to get the cheese bomb, I guess. <laughs> comes with a ladle of pepper jack cheese sauce. You have to say it's in wild and a little outrageous, served with scony too. Yeah. <laughs> and then I think I'm going to get the, the fibrillator because I'm hungry. Two beef patties. Oh my God. And then topped with chicken fried bacon and classic cheese curds. And then Ava Gray's going to get the mac and cheese, right? Yeah. Mm, and it's homemade, it said. All so right. it's not like the craft mac and cheese. Cool. <laughs> yeah. That'll be good. Oh, I don't think I'm going to explain Here's this. Here's right. I guess yeah. these were the regular okay. curds. These are the giant curds. These are the mozzarella curds that go with the marinara's dipping sauce. Those are the hot ones. You've got a couple seasoned uh, what, pepper jack curds, and then these are the Ellsworth from Ellsworth, Wisconsin. Fair curds. They're like mini. We'll try one. Let's try a mini one. Okay. So these, let's do a mini. Yeah, hold on here. Wait, gotta string it first. Look. Okay, hold on. Oh my goodness. String it. What do you think, Kyle? Yeah. Oh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I've been buying one. Mm -hmm. Alright guys, this is their famous original cheese curds. And we got two kinds of ranches one? here. This is regular ranch and this is Chipotle ranch. Okay. So I would dip this. It? Let me see. Oh man. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> also, can we talk about this root beer real quick? Yeah, look at that root beer. Um, <laughs> can we talk about How is it? Hang on. <laughs> okay, so this is um I would dip this in the Chipotle ranch because okay. because the other ones are spicy. How's that? Mm. What do you think, Kyle? Mm -hmm. oh, <laughs> and look at the size of his root beer. All right, we got the regular cheese curds here. <laughs> Woo! Good. Those are so good. How is everything here today? Very oh, good. Amazing. Good. I heard you guys just moved here. Yeah. How exciting. Very good. Do you like to be on camera? <laughs> I don't mind it. I would go up in theater. Hi. Hi. This Hi. is amazing. Good. I'm so glad. Wow, very good. Oh, hopefully it'll be a new hot spot for you guys. No, oh, so. yeah. We haven't uh, experienced cheese curds like this. Oh, yeah? <laughs> no, no, I cheese guess curds that. in California. No? I don't believe it. I mean, you know, I'm, I've been here my whole life. I gotta say, I've been blessed by the cheese curds. All right. But, no, I, get, I had a friend from Tennessee come up here one time, and I was like, you have to have the cheese curds. He's like, you mean like deep fried cheese nuggets? Had no idea what I was talking about. Now you're going to try the mozzarella cheese curd dipped in marinara. That's like more like a traditional cheese stick, I guess, huh? Uh-huh. How's that? Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. We decided to get Kyle a, a root beer since they don't have free refills. <laughs> yeah. We decided to get the big one. How is it, Kyle? Really good. <laughs> and it's on draft. They have root beer on draft here. <laughs> she wants to be on the video. Yeah, let's dip it. I just, I just tried the, I'm having the marinara sauce. The marinara sauce? Yeah, I'm, I'm working on my... Uh, let me have a dip. Oh, these so mozzarella good. ones are delicious. Let me try it, Dad. This is so good. It's like, oh, it is. It's kind of like spaghetti I'm tomatoes. Right. Yeah. It's like spaghetti tomatoes. Here you go, Grace. I peeled off so some what, of what kind of, Oh, that's a pepper jack one. Oh, look at that. It's stringy, all right. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Good. If it's real stringy, it's real fresh. Look at that. Wow. This looks good. Oh, it's hot. Mm. So, I mean, wow, I don't know which one I like better. Do you like the cheese curds here better than Northern Tap House or about the same? I think they're better here. <laughs> wow, I didn't even think that we'd ever say that. If you go slow, it doesn't break. Oh my goodness, and that Chipotle Ranch? <laughs> Watch, Kyle knows how to do it. Oh, you got the wrong one. Those are the little ones. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Okay, so here's the pepper jack. I'm trying to. Well, here comes my beer. 
for the 34 ounce beer. Yes, right here, please. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Look at that. <laughs> okay, Dad. Look at right. this. Ooh, it's got a little bit of. Look at that. Yeah. Okay, Monica, well, don't make a scene. Eat it. <laughs> I am. It's amazing. That's a little spicy. So I'll go for the regular ranch, even though I do like spice. That's good. Wow. Wow, is right. And my big beer here, just to let you guys know, the Brewing Project Deadly Allure from Eau Claire, 8.38. They also have growlers you can take home, but look at that thing. Same size as your root beer, Kyle. How this came to be. So the manager came over and showed us the thing in the front and gave us uh, the information for this gentleman that's a local food truck. And she said you have to hook up with him and gave us his number. She went and looked it up on the computer from his website. So I'm definitely going to look it up. And then she said, and just. Then she said. She gave us a $10 gift certificate for next time we come. So, boy, Wisconsin's been friendly to us, huh? She must have gone on your site because she spelled your name right. Yeah? Well, it's on the back of my card. Oh, that's my right. My name is okay. Eric. So. I forgot we gave her the card. How awesome. Yeah. All right, here's my burger with the blue cheese potato salad. Look at this burger. A double cheeseburger with cheese curds on top. <laughs> Ava Gray's got the mac and cheese. I got, it. I got strawberry gober, fries, and mac and cheese. And now let's see yours. Oh, they we're going to give her an applesauce, actually. Okay. okay. Let's see yours. No, I chose a gober. Okay. All right. And mine is the bomb burger. So it's got like the fried onions, and it's got bacon, and it's got double cheddar cheese and, and avocado. And a ladle of cheese And a ladle sauce. of, yeah, this is pepper jack cheese sauce. So you put it over the top, and you eat it with like a fork and a knife. And then Kyle got giant tater tots. Look at these things. You want to try one? Uh, Mom says there's cheese in it. I don't know if there's cheese in it so. or not. No, there's not. No, it's just a tater tot. Oh. No, I... How is it? Hot. <laughs> and then what kind of burger? Oh, you got the hangover burger, right? Or what was it called? I made a mistake and gave me a price. So what was the name of his? The hangover burger? It was a hangover burger. And it's got a fried egg on top. I know, but then you don't get apple sauce. All right. Man, oh, man. That looks good. All right. You, know, so you want me to cut it in half for you, or are you going to go for it that way? He means business. Let's do this. All right. All right. Let's, let's do, do this. this. Oh, look at him. <laughs> let's see inside. Oh, look, big let's see inside the burger. Oh, yeah. How is it? So good. <laughs> it's good? <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Do you remember exactly what's on that burger? You said there's yeah. there's the onion You're ring, welcome. onion straws. It's got onion straws. Open it's it got up. the pecan wood bacon. She put avocado on. It's got avocado on it. Double cheddar. That's pretty much it. And then it. try that Wisconsin. Was it pepper jack here? cheese sauce? Do we need anything? Yeah. Pepper jack cheese sauce. But boy, oh boy, this is gonna. Are you gonna I pour guess... it? Pick up the burger, pour it underneath. <laughs> yeah, I think I have to use like a knife and a fork. Oh my gosh, I'm like trying to figure out how to eat this. How do they normally eat that? Most people just pour it right on top. Okay. Like, all over it. Just like, like that? this. All right. Make it pretty. Oh my gosh. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> Probably you... put some on your fries too. Huh? No, it's no. going on the burger. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I know. <laughs> Not enough cheese. Yeah. I'm All not right. eating healthy today. <laughs> well, this is healthy, actually. Lots of calcium. Look at that. Pepper right. jack cheese. I want you to try a bite. Ooh. Tell us how it is. Okay. Great. Let me share that I'm going to eat this. No. Oh, wait. All right. Whoops. I'll eat a fry. Mm. It's good? So good. Oh my gosh, it's so good. I don't believe you. And then next, after that, I'll do two. All right, hang on, Avery. Okay, just cut a little piece. I want to see. Cut it in half first, maybe, huh? I guess. All right. It's going to be huge. <laughs> oh, that looks good. I don't even know if I can do this. All right. Let's open it up and see what's going on. Oh, my gosh. Look. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Need more cheese. Yeah. <laughs>
Cut a bite and tell, see what the... Doing it right now. Shut. I was about to say, you can't pick that up. No. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. Who, who's ever had a burger where you pour cheese sauce on top? There's bacon in it. <laughs> There's bacon in it? Pecan wood bacon. And how about yours, Kyle? You're happy? Yeah. Oh, you try a bite. All right. Well, hang on. Take another bite for the camera. Wow. Wow. Hangover burger. <laughs> Wow. All right. So what is that again? This is called the defibrillator. Is that pronounced right? Defib I defibrillator. I don't know. <laughs> How am I supposed to do this? <laughs> Maybe I should hang on, let me pull this. The oh, key, that's bacon. The key is to eat the eat it before the cheese curds get so cold. Look, that's like some kind of fry, what do they call that? Country fried bacon. Oh. Chicken fried bacon. Chicken fried bacon. Mmm. All right. I think I might try to cut it in half. <laughs> okay. All right. They make it so good. Look at that, man. Oh. Okay, let me see if I can separate it here. <laughs> oh, wow. Can you see that? With cheese curds on top and bacon to this uh, country fried bacon? Chicken fried bacon. Chicken fried bacon. Oh, wow. Okay. That looks delicious. Let me Let's try. See. Oh, my goodness. Really? That's a heart attack waiting to happen. All right. <laughs> mm. That's a good burger. No, I have to say, I think I found my new favorite place. <laughs> mm. And I haven't tried the blue cheese potato salad yet. Alright, let's eat. <laughs> Look at that cheese curd just hanging off on <laughs> Cheese curd burger, baby. And the, the meat is a really good quality. Oh, there's a couple things, by the way, that they have on their menu. They have that, I don't know what the name of it is, but they have these premium patties where they like, they do like brisket. And... Cheers. Did, and then there's that challenge, huh? Eight patties and... Yeah, they have an eight burger, eight slices of cheese, double bur double bun burger. You can eat it in what half French fried hour? onions and bacon and all bunch of stuff. You can eat it in 30 minutes, 30 yeah. 30 minutes, you get a t-shirt, they put you on their social media. <laughs> but I, I, I'm not going to have a hard time just finishing this double burger, so. <laughs> Well, you enjoy it. I had one patty and I had a hard time finishing it. Yeah, it's good. All right. Completely stuffed. On our way home, what are our final thoughts? Let's start I think with that. Uh, it's a lot better than a Northern Tap House, that's for sure. I think so too. I what think, did you think, Gabriel? Me Grace? too. I think it's kind of better, and um, I think that um, that I think I think that it should be better to make really good mac and cheese and burger. All right. And one thing I got, I didn't tell you guys. <clears throat> The waitress gave us a $10 gift certificate, not the waitress, the manager. She came over and talked to us and it was very nice. And then she came over and said, you guys want to join our meat raffle? I'm like, meat raffle? What's a meat raffle? And she goes, you've never heard of a meat <laughs> and raffle? And she's like, you never heard of a meat raffle? And we're like, no, what's a meat raffle? But I guess they do it every Sunday, 10 slots. And From our uh, favorite, like, rumps. Yeah, let me... Let me uh, not our favorite, but... Let me pull out my phone because I took a picture of it, of all the things you can win. And basically what it is, you chip in $10 and they only take 10 people. And then every Sunday 20, they do it. 20. Or 20 people. 20 and slots. then whoever wins, they pick it. Whoever wins gets all the stuff in the meat raffle. So let me see what it was. I took a picture of it. And it changes every week. 
So here's what the meat raffle had in it if we would have won. We did win. We bought two tickets. I bought one for myself and one for Monica. So let's see. You, you got, uh, if you would have won for a $10 entry, uh, two porterhouse steaks, two pounds of beef stew meat, one pound of shrimp, two pork tenderloins, uh, bacon cheeseburger patties, mushroom and Swiss bratwurst, uh, a pound of blackberry chipotle bacon, barbecue shredded chicken, smoked chorizo, two pounds of Jamaican jerk chicken wings, meatballs, and sriracha gouda cheese. I mean, are you kidding me? So uh, I guess every uh, every week they do that, and there's a local butcher in town, uh, Rumps, which was the same butcher where we got those uh, cheese curds and beef sticks. It's the next town over uh, from from, where we from live. our landlord when we moved in from Christina. We went down there and visit. It's a very nice little local butcher shop here in uh, Eau Claire. But yeah, they have some high end meat and. Uh, yeah, they had a little contest, a meat raffle. I never even heard of such a thing. But they said, yeah, every Sunday we start a new meat raffle and we draw. Whenever we get the full list, we draw it. And then uh, people come back on Monday and pick up their meat. So we're going to continue to go back because I really like that place. What about you, Malika? I did. I, I liked it. Also, I liked that their fries, besides the fact that the burger was really, really good, they, um, they have a house sauce, like a dipping sauce, that's similar to like In-N-Out sauce, but it's definitely a lot more, it tastes fresher. I like that, but also their fries, they still have the skin on them. You can, it's got that, they're fresh. They're fresh cut fries. I really like Yeah, and I had, I had a blue cheese potato salad, which was, which was delicious. It was really blue cheesy. Yeah, it's and I mean, rich, everything there was really good. And of course, having the, whatever it was, 36 rotating beers. And they're all local Wisconsin beers on tap, which, you know, I'm there already, okay, so. But the blue cheese potato salad, I had a bite of it. It wasn't necessarily my thing um, because it was really rich, but it still had a really good flavor, so. But hey, for a chain restaurant, I have to say I'm really impressed. The food was delicious. I would highly recommend it. Uh, good beer, good cheese, uh, the best cheese curds I've had, even beat our old favorite, even Kyle admits that, right Kyle? Their cheese curds were better than uh, yeah. the other tap house? Uh -huh. Yeah, I mean, and the fact that they're a size of golf balls, I guess, I love, except those little fair ones. And I had their fresh brewed iced tea, and, uh, and that was actually really good as well. So anyway guys, a little different video for you today. We decided to do a review of a local restaurant chain here in Wisconsin. It was absolutely delicious. Milwaukee Burger Company, right? Yep, Milwaukee Burger I Company. I would highly recommend it. Shout out to Allie, who is the manager who gave us the gift card. And, and uh, what was our waitress? And our waitress was Cameron. Yeah, Cameron. Thank you, Cameron. A freshman at uh, Eau Claire. Eau Claire. Uh, College. Yep. Uh, working there. She said seven days a week she's working there, which I can't believe. So, so we support Cameron. She was a great, great uh, server. Yes. So again, guys, I appreciate you watching the video. If you like it, please hit the like button. I would love it if you would consider subscribing. Just hit the subscribe button, and I'll leave a link below and above to my website, ericsmokingbarbecue.com. We really appreciate uh, all your continued support and watching our videos. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to do more uh, food reviews of restaurants and stuff like that. I just thought I'd try something different. Yeah, just like we did with the Culver's. Just like we did for Culver's and In-N-Out, exactly. I'm just trying to offer you guys. Oh, and uh, one more thing. Oh, one more thing. Shout out, <laughs> shout out to the, um, what was um, their name, Mom? Uh, the at Northern Tap House, our waiter. Now that I don't remember. Uh, <laughs> I wish I could. Whatever, whatever your name was, shout out to you. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, she was, she was a nice waitress to tell us. I guess it's owned by the same parent company, but she said, yeah, go try the cheese curds over there. So thanks for that recommendation, else we probably never would have tried it, or at least not this soon. All right, guys, again, appreciate bye. you watching. Say bye, guys. Bye. 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 And here we go, driving home on our little side street. All right, guys. See you later.